Hey guys and gals, this is Scott Ramirez. Today I'm going to be showing you how to unlock all the characters and the, all the achievements in Risk of Rain by hacking the save file. As you can see, I haven't unlocked any characters and I haven't unlocked any achievements or played any games for that matter. Um, just uh, take a note that this won't unlock your Steam achievements unfortunately, only your in-game achievements. Uh, so let's get started. Alrighty, so first thing you want to do is go to your Steam files. Uh, so that's usually in your program folder. And go to Steam Apps, Common, and find your Risk of Rain folder. Cool, alright, so there's two files we want to edit. Save.ini and save underscore backup.ini. Uh, yours should look similar. Uh, probably got a lot more stuff in there, considering this is a fresh save. And Basically, you'll have two sections in there. One will be record. I have to create mine. Yours should already be there. And I'm only going to edit one of the files for now. And to unlock an achievement, it's pretty easy. All you got to do is type in achievement, the ID of the achievement. I'll just use zero for now. And equals two. Two means it's been unlocked. Um, down in your records section of the file, you'll find a field, I guess you could call it, called achievement, uh, what's it, achievement number unlocked, and this should equal the amount of achievements you have set to be unlocked in the file, so that's equal to one right now, um, but I've got a couple of IDs here that I'm just going to copy paste in there, like this, bam, I'm going to put uh, some info in the description of every ID and uh, which achievement it relates to. We'll probably fill that description right up there. Um, so that's one, two, three. I think that's a debt 10. So I'm going to check that's right, it's 10. Cool, so I'm going to check 10. Perfect. I'm going to save that. I'm going to select all of it and copy that. And I'm going to go to my save underscore backup dot any file, select all of that and paste it to make sure that the files are identical. And I'm just going to make sure I've saved both of them. And then I'm going to close them. Alright, so I'm just going to jump back into the game and see if it's all worked. Alrighty, we're back in Risk of Rain. Uh, as you can see, we've unlocked all the characters. Uh, we'll go back, check my achievements. Uh, as you can see, zero time played. Uh, defeat 20 Lemurians in one playthrough. That's been unlocked. That was achievement ID zero. Uh, and all the achievements related to unlocking extra characters have been unlocked, which is what I selected. Uh, if you guys want to unlock all the achievements, all you have to do is put them all in that file with an equals 2 next to them, and that'll unlock them all. Just make sure you remember to set the number of achievements unlocked to the amount of achievements there are. I think there's 48, uh, and that'll, that should work. And you can also use this method to unlock stuff in the monster log. Actually, I've got nothing, but if you put mons, M-O-N-S, uh, 0 to 29 with an equals 1 next to it, uh, that'll unlock it. And that has the same kind of mechanic where it has the number of monster logs unlocked. Uh, so just make sure you make that equal to 30 if you've unlocked all of them. Um, and you can do the same with the item log, but just make sure you've got the achievement that actually unlocks the item, or else it won't count towards your score. Cool, uh, so that's the end of my video guys, uh, leave any questions in the comments section and I'll get back to you guys as soon as I can.